Hey, uh, hey, I wanted to show you guys my current morning, night, and mass day winter skincare routine. If you have acne, breakouts, or dark spots, this is for you too. I'm using a range of affordable to expensive products. All items will be linked below. And let's get started with my morning routine. Hi to all my beautiful people out there. I love starting my routines with some sort of goal. My morning routine is always to make sure that I'm using lightweight but hydrating products. I can never start a routine without those black muffs. I love whoever invented those. These acne dark spots, not cute. So we're starting with the Kate Somerville Exfoliate Cleanser. Got this from Sephora. I love her. She does not have any beading. She is nice and creamy. The smell is a little, mm, but she gets the job done. That's all that matters. This Target exfoliating pad is soft and gentle. It does lift up some of the dirt. I love using face towelettes. You could get these from Amazon, Shein even. The Fenty Skin Fat Water Toner. She is milky. She is creamy. And she also helps with pigmentation and dark spots, guys. This is great for all skin types. It has niacinamide, hyaluronic acid, Acid and tamarind. It always makes my skin feel plump, juicy, and hydrated. The Hero Pimple Pen you can get from Ulta or Target. I love this because it has salicylic acid with lactic acid and tea tree. You can use it on pimples that are fresh. You can use it on pimples that you feel like is about to come. Following up with the lightning wand from Hero, it does the job serum wise. It gets those dark spots faded. And note, guys, that throughout this video, some things will be repetitive. Of course, caffeine eye cream to get whatever stubborn bags out of the way. This Cococine Chlorophyll Discoloration Serum is chef's kiss. I never knew that some sort of serum can assist in this capacity, but it feels so good and so hydrating. And yes, I double up on my serum. So now we're going to go in with Good Molecules Daily Brightening Serum. All of these items are lightweight and inexpensive and great quality items. I love Youth to the People. I use their Air Whip Moisture Cream and you'll see the nighttime mask in the nighttime routine. Very little goes a long way. I also double up on moisturizers as well because this does not have SPF in it. And that is when the e.l.f. Holy Hydration comes into play. This entire line I live by. Hyaluronic acid, peptides, great texture, just good and creamy, not too thick consistency. This Blistex, it literally has cocoa butter in it and it has SPF. Now I can enjoy my beautiful hydrated day and let's get into the nighttime routine. My nighttime goals are to prevent any acne from coming in as well as brightening the skin. So let's get into it with Panoxyl. I was afraid of Panoxyl because I am not acne prone initially. I am a normal to oily skin girl, but the hormonal acne has kicked in in my old age. I tried out the antibacterial soap thanks to Kyra I'm Unique. And that duo is the Holy Grail, as well as this one, Incorporating Ice. It plumps the skin. It gets the job going. I, <laughs> I don't know why I've never iced my skin prior to this. Pat Dry, of course. Thayer's Milky Toner. Who knew that mushrooms were great for your skin? As well as it has hyaluronic acid. It is not as thick as the Fenty, but it is more hydrating in my opinion. Yes, we have to fan this away. I do not own a real fan, but you get it. Paula's Choice. I never knew I needed a liquid exfoliant in my life. She is more on the expensive side. However, she is worth it because I wake up the next day with smooth texture, brighter skin, any type of blackheads or anything that wanted to pop out, it came out. Since it's nighttime, I do want an extra little plump. So now I'm going to use the caffeine eye cream from earlier, as well as the Good Molecules Herba, I believe that's how you pronounce it, eye cream, following up with some Aquaphor. Put Aquaphor under your eyes and it will be a game changer. I learned that tip from Khloe Kardashian. I said, wow, Lancome, another pricey item, but this Clarifique is magnifique. It works like a charm, but it hydrates, it illuminates, and it makes your skin glow. It is so beautiful. Look at that. Look at that. Yes. 
banana bright from Olay Henriksen. If you have not tried this, girl, you are sleeping. I kid you not. Once you learn what your skin loves, the products will just seep in beautifully and you will wake up gorgeous than ever. My skin loves citrus, rose water, hyaluronic acid, and niacinamide, as well as squalene, which this Youth to the People mask has, as well as berries. So when my skin touches any of those items, ah. Uh, and of course, we got to go to bed with a lip mask. Fenty's Plush Pudding, Chef's Kiss. It is better than Laneige. I kid you not. Now we're ready to go to bed. Look at that glow. Oh my gosh. Now we're into mask day. And mask day for me is brightening day. And I'm always happy for mask day. Look at me. Tree Hut Brightening Sugar Face Scrub. I will tell you now, the sugar in here is a little intense. And intense, I would say maybe like a 7 out of 10. Use very little just so you can get a feel for it. But I love it. Salicylic Acid Cleanser from Inky List. I just love to follow up with something very gentle. It has a fantastic lather for it to feel as thin as it does. Then here comes the mask. If you've never used this Cherry Dub face mask from Fenty, the AHAs, you feel the tingle. You wake up glowing. You're glowing even when the mask is on. Look at that glow. The mask is on and you literally just have to leave it on for 10 minutes. Yeah, I'm feeling my because I already know I'm about to wake up like the badder bitch that I am. And then this is the skincare completely done. I did the whole serums, the moisturizers, everything you guys seen from the morning and nighttime routine already. But look at the skin. Look at the skin. The glow. It is there. Like, way. It still looks like I even have the mask on. This is when you feel yourself. This is when you tell yourself you are that girl because you know you're already that girl. Ankylish Tri-Peptide Plumping Lip Balm. It is scentless. It strengthens your lip barrier. It also provides the normal and natural hydration that we should have in our lips. But thank you for watching. I hope this was helpful. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to keep up with your girl.